morning, everyone. I'm Pastor Greg Cheslick from 4th Avenue United Methodist Church in Faribault, Minnesota. Today is Palm Sunday, and unfortunately, we can't gather together in our sanctuary to celebrate today. But we can gather online, and I want to speak to the children this morning. This is a day of great celebration. We wave palm branches and remember the story of Jesus' triumphal entry into Jerusalem. We remember how the crowds cried out, Hosanna, which means, God, save us. We too need God to save us. And God is so gracious and loving. He wants to rescue us and help us through our difficulties. And we're going through a very difficult time right now, aren't we? Having to stay home and, and be away from those that we love. So I want to tell the, read, tell the story of Jesus' triumphal entry into Jerusalem. And then it will lead into the story of Jesus' death on the cross. It's an important week that we're about to, to celebrate called Holy Week. So listen to the story. One day Jesus came to town, and people threw their garments down. They all began to shout and cheer, Hosanna, Hosanna, Jesus is here. But when the leaders in that town heard the cheers, it made them frown. They didn't like to see this man, and so they made a wicked plan. They came to get him late at night, with all their torches burning bright. The leaders took him to a place where soldiers laughed and hid his face. And when the sun had risen high, they put him on a cross to die. They didn't know he was God's son, and that he died for everyone. Jesus' friends all wondered why the Son of God would have to die. They came and took his body down, and sadly laid it in the ground. They sealed the tomb and walked away. There's never been a sadder day. So this is a crazy day when we celebrate the passion of Jesus as well as the palm parade. It begins in a high note of celebration and then it ends with our reflection on Jesus' death upon the cross. He loves us that much that he was willing to die upon the cross. And we continue to wave our palm branches and offer our prayers crying out to him, come and save us. And he's promised that whoever calls upon the name of the Lord will be saved. Thanks for sharing this time with me. I hope you have a wonderful Holy Week. We'll continue to reflect on God's great love for us in Jesus. And we'll look forward to gathering next Sunday again to celebrate Jesus' resurrection from the dead.